behalf of Bay High School, I'm Jessa and it's Security Campus News. Students, get ready! Coming this Friday is the opening night of Beauty and the Beast. Here's Mr. Galvin with more information. Good afternoon everybody. Just a reminder, this Friday Beauty and the Beast opens here at Half Moon Bay High School in the MU. We got 7 p.m. on Friday and Saturday, 2 p.m. on Sunday. Really hope to see you all come out. See you there. Have a great day. Attention seniors, celebrate graduation with all your friends at grad night. An all night party planned just for seniors that includes food, entertainment, prizes, and games that you can enjoy nonstop as you spend one last night together. Prizes include a MetaQuest VR, iPads, Sony headphones, Beats, and AirPods. Register now at the website you see below. Now, once again, here's a video about a unique chance to travel to visit Japan. Good morning, Half Moon Bay High. My name is Laura, and I'm with a nonprofit called the Half Moon Bay Kadiwa Sister City Association. You may have met me at the most recent community service jam in the MU. I'm here today to let you know that our application for our summer 2024 ambassador trip to Japan is open now. We're looking for two sophomores or juniors in high school to be our ambassadors for this trip. Speaking Japanese is not a requirement. All we are wanting to look for are enthusiastic students who want to learn about Japanese culture and represent our city on this trip. The trip itself is three weeks long between June and July, and you'd be staying with host families in our sister city of Kariwamura, Japan. When I was in high school, way back when, I heard about this trip on these very announcements. I applied, I was chosen, and I got to go on my trip in 2010. It was an absolutely life-changing experience. It, um, it was one of the best trips I have ever been on. And yes, the yukata that I'm wearing right now is from that very trip. Um, to apply for this opportunity, please visit our website that you can see now on the screen. The application will be available until Friday, March 15th online on our website. And we look forward to reading your applications. Thank you so much. Get ready, Cougars. In exactly one month, we'll be having our powder puff game. So let's stay tuned for some more information. Uh, powder puff is traditionally when girls play flag football and guys cheer. Unlike our last powder puff game, anyone in the school can join. Yeah. If you're on the half of the high school football or cheer teams, make sure to sign up to coach. If enough underclassmen sign up, there's going to be a JV game, which is freshmen versus sophomores at 5.30, and the varsities game is going to be at 7, which is juniors versus seniors. We're going to have an informational meeting this Thursday at lunch in D3. Be there. Scan the QR codes around the school and make sure to follow the Powder Puff Leadership Instagram. The boys tennis team fell to Menlo Atherton last Thursday. James Travis made his return to the courts and fought hard but eventually fell 6-2, 6-2. Vince Vela battled in the second set and almost forced a tiebreak at number 4 singles. Tyler Handel and Rio Forchini played a tough match and gave their opponents all they could handle before dropping a number 1 doubles match 6-3, 6-2.